Can I can I have one chance and I got a scare and got a spirit all the time? My name is Simon J. Spirit of Wild. I'm here to give you a word on tonight. And we're gonna talk about the wise and the fool, foolish building. Now um you know Jesus is gonna be talking to hell. You know, Jesus um teaches the wise, you know, and the foolish, you know, builder. You know, both of them gonna be builders. You know, now that probably illustrate the importance of building one life on obedience, you know, to the teaching, and both would listen to Jesus' word, but when he was teaching, but one applied to their life, and the other failed to ignore it. You know, so the wise is having, you know, having a showing experience, you know, knowledge, and have a good judgment. You know, but the foolish, you know, lacking good sense of justice being unwise. You know, so therefore everyone who hear these words of oh mine and put them into practice, you know, it's like a wise man who built his house on a rock. You know, so that's what that's what he comparing it to. You know, he teaching that word. Now he said if you listen to the word, you know, and you apply it to your life. You know, it's like, you know, built your house on a, on a rock. You know, because they can, you can have, you can have about 10 people in church. That, and, and, and they're looking at the pastor, you know, but that don't mean they're listening, you know, and applying it to their life. You know, you can have, you can have two, three people. They have an incident happen. You, you'll have three people telling a different story. You know, so he had both of them there. Teaching that word, but only one was listening and applying to their life. You know, the other one just did what it know, you know, and did, did not apply nothing to his life. You know, so the two people Jesus compared at the end of the sermon on a might have several points in common. They have several points in common, you know, both them bill. So that's what they have in common there. Both them bill, you know, uh, they, they both heard Jesus' word. So both of them feel, both of them heard Jesus' word, you know. Now some people can hear the word, just like you, you know. They can hear the word, you know, but a lot of them want you to take it because you are asking, well, what, what, what was taught today? I don't know. You know, so that's how he was. Jesus taught, was teaching to both of them, you know, but only one was listening, studying, and comparing to their life. You know, so the uh, so the two build on a rock. You know, when you build on a rock, mean to hear the word and put it to practice. You know, so uh, so when when you when you put the word to practice, you know, you apply it to your life. You know, so when the rain come, you know, and the storm come, you know, bamming on your house, the stream rose and the wind blew and bent against your house, you know, but yet it did not fall, you know, because it had a foundation on the rock, you know, because he applied his house, you know, on a word that Jesus was preaching, you know, so that's why when that wind came, the storm came, bamming out on the house, everything came, but nothing didn't tear that house down, you know, that house did not get to my you know, because it was built on side of rock. You know, so now those who follow Jesus teaching are like a wise man who built his house on a rock. You know, so those who ignore him are like a foolish man who built his house on sand. So that's what he's saying. He said the one that's listened to his word is like they build a house on a rock. But if if a one do not listen to his word, you know, and don't apply anything to his life, that means he built his house on sand, you know. So this man built his house, you know, on a rock because he listened to Jesus' word, you know, and he applied to his life, you know. So when the wind came, you know, on his house, it did not fall. He was wise. He was wise, you know. So, But everyone who hears these words of mine and does not put it to practice, you know, it's like a foolish man who built his house on sand. 
you know so that's what he's saying you read the house on saying that because you ignore the word and you refuse to listen to that word you know so the rain came so this to this one that the one that built his house on the sand you know so when the rain came you know the wind came you know the stream came rose and, and, and blowing and hitting against his house you know beat against it like it did the other house it did the same thing with the other house you know but that house you know all that beating it and the wind pushing on that house the house had fell down you know not on it fall down it crashed down you know because it was built on sand you know because he was there with the other man you know but he ignored jesus word now this is a man who did not listen to jesus word you know but he heard it you know but he ignored it so he was foolish you know to build his house on sand you know so everyone who hear these words you know of mine and doesn't do them will be like a foolish man you know who built his house on sand you know by him ignoring jesus you know his house came crashing down you know so when jesus had finished you know saying these things you know the crowd was amazed you know as he's teaching they always was amazed every time he teach you know because he taught as one who had authority you know and not as their teacher of the law you know so he taught at authority you know because he wanted them to get it. see when jesus taught he wanted them to get it so he talked with authority you know so uh so the teacher of the law quote authority to support their argument you know but jesus has has spoke with a new authority of his own you know so the result of wise and foolish you know is that the storm or trials tribulation you know eventually the final judgment you know he or she stand firm you know one or the other you know had another like the wise heard christ's word but does not act upon it you know and does not obey it. you know so a wise you know listen to jesus word and apply to his life you know so when the wind came the storm came and that strong wind was just beating all on side against the house you know his house did not fall it was solid because it was built on a rock you know, but the foolish, the foolish ignore the word. You know, he ignored the word. He did not want to listen to Jesus' word. You know, so that's why when his tribulation came in his life, you know, the storm and the wind came. You know, that's when the tribulation and every, the trials, everything just started coming against him. You know, being on his house. You know, and what happened? You know, everything come tumbling down. You know, because he built his house on sand. Because he refused to put listen to Jesus' word and put it to practice. You know, so that's the story on the wise and the foolish built. Both them was built, you know, and both them was, both them was at Jesus. At Jesus, when Jesus was preaching, you know. And so, uh, both them was there listening. No, not listening. Both them was there. You know, the other heard the word, but he turned his head, you know, ignoring, you know, so when he left out of there, you know, he didn't look with, with the arm of God on him, you know, he just looked empty hand, you know, so that's why he built his house on sand, you know, in a wise, you know, he, he was like Mary, you know, sucking everything in, you know, so his tribulation came, the stone came, you know, he was able to handle his ground, you know, his house did not fall, you know, because he put that word into practice, you know, so that's all the word I have for you on today, you know, y'all have a blessed and nice day, and I see y'all on the next video.